guys, this is Versatile from Game Dexterity. So I got a super quick tutorial in quotations, of course, because nothing is quick when you're trying to do a backup of your Nintendo Wii NAN memory. So it's pretty simple. I'm going to make some quick assumptions here is that you already installed the Homebrew channel and you already installed the Boot Me as well. If you don't know what I'm talking about, go ahead and watch my other video that shows you how to use the letter bomb on your Nintendo Wii system so that you can install that hack. And then from there, you can go ahead and proceed to install not only the homebrew channel but also the boot me program preferably if your Nintendo Wii is I think is um, older than 2008 so 2007 or older you can install the boot me program as your boot to uh, OS if not then your boot me will be the iOS and you gotta go that route which is what I have since my Nintendo Wii was made in 2011 so with that said let's jump straight into that video tutorial all right, so in today's video, I'm gonna show you how simple it is to do a backup of your NAN on your Nintendo Wii. So let's turn on a Nintendo Wii real quick here. And we'll just plow right through this. All right, so press A to continue. So what I'm gonna do is go to the homebrew channel and go to start. All right, so here's a list of different apps that I have. So let's press home on this um, nunchuck here and let's go down to boot me and press the A button. Now granted, I don't have a plug-in Wii controller or a plug-in GameCube controller. So what I'm gonna use is if you press the power button on your Nintendo Wii, you can actually scroll through the menu. So for example, if I push this power button, you see that the homebrew channel is highlighted. If I push the power button one more time, you see the SD card is highlighted. So if I press on the reset button, you see that you have this menu come up. So I don't want that, so I press, um, let's go exit and let's go to, sorry, let's set this back up again. I'm gonna go to this right here, the gear. So press the power, press the reset button. Now this one right here is where you wanna back up your contents of your flash memory to your SD card. So let's do that, so let's press the reset button. And here it says, ready to back up the NAN. NAN.bin will be overwritten. Press A or reset to continue. So let's press the reset. And now it will proceed to start going through all this um, blocks here and proceed to back it up to your memory card, your SD memory card. So this will take a while, maybe, I don't know, five, 10 minutes. So I'm just gonna let this run. After it gets to the very end here, what it's going to do is it's going to do a verification backup. So I'm gonna let it sit and then I'm gonna um, cut through the video here and cut to the specific portions of the video and then we'll talk about the next steps there. All right, so in this portion of the video, what has happened is it has just gone through and going through the verifying the backup. This takes again, you know, a couple minutes, five, 10 minutes. So we'll just wait, uh, wait this out. Okay, sweet, so the verification is done. So let's hit any button to exit. Um, okay, I'll push it on the Wii here. And that is that. So now if I go back to, uh, if you want to restore your NAN backup, this is what you need to do. Finally get to boot me, run this, and you can restore your backup, pretty simple. And then if I go back to the loader here, um, go back to the Wii, all is good. So that's how you do the backup of your NAN flash memory on your Nintendo Wii. So with that said, let's go straight back to the desktop. All right, so as you can clearly see, it's pretty simple. Now, granted, I just backed up my NAN. I did not brick my Wii. I'm not going to even try to brick my Wii to show you guys how to restore it. I will put a link in the more info section so you can read guides on what to do if you did brick your Wii and how you can properly restore it. So see the more info section. If you like these type of videos, please like, favorite, and subscribe so that we can get on the front page of YouTube. Otherwise, please leave a comment here on the YouTube page, and I'll get back to you as soon as possible. Once again, thank you for watching. Take care. Bye.